Hello. We're here to demonstrate the ACAST uh, safety laser for press brakes today. This model is the Fiesler ACAST 2F. Uh, it is equipped with an automatic uh, setup for uh, changeover uh, punch tips. Um, let me explain a little better because this is a demo unit. Um, there are brackets that hold the receiver and the sender and are mounted to the sides of the press brake and actually this system will go up and down with the press brake always covering the tip of the punch. Um, also it has a swivel bracket that the swivel is mounted on one end and you can actually unclamp it and swivel the unit out of the way so you can slide your punches in and out bring it back and clamp it back down again it lines the lasers right back up again so I'm going to go ahead and demonstrate <clears throat> the ACAST has uh, basically three lasers here uh, two underneath the punch and one out in front of the punch um, and I'll demonstrate that now as you're bending if you happen to slip off uh, it'll stop it automatically you can get back on off the pedal back on the pedal it doesn't shut the press brake off and you can make your bend um, the other unique feature of lasers is the opportunity in, in box bending is that we can actually mute out the front beam and still have two beams on underneath so if anybody reached inside a box or outside a box it'll still be safe and you can still uh, run the system. As you can see here, we're going ahead and make this bend. And it, and it followed the, the laser followed the lines and was able to make the box bend. Uh, if this was a, a, a light curtain situation, you're going to have to be back 8 to 12 inches. You have to lay your part in there and get a quarter inch. Or <clears throat> go ahead and put your, when it gets to the quarter inch, then you can insert your part and manipulate it. Um, the other nice feature about the ACAST 2F is that we have what we call wavy material. If this is a sheet wave that would come along there, it doesn't know if it's my finger or the sheet. This way you get off the pedal, hit, hit the pedal again, and then it makes the bend. The pedal's down here, and as you hit it, it comes up and would make the bend. Um, <clears throat> the, uh, the feature here we talked about was the setup mode. Uh, what we would do if you change this punch height out and it's lower and we need to reset that laser uh, Which all lasers have to be reset underneath the punch tip when they're changed out because that's the point of operation We turn this switch to the setup mode We push the button as soon as it goes down and clears the tip of the punch We push up on a little toggle switch here and then we turn this back to the run mode now, as you can see, <clears throat> it's optical linking from end to end. This could be a 33-foot press break. This is all you have to do. And roughly about 14 seconds by the time you grab your part, as you can see here now, it's blinking, and we are safe at this point. Uh, this is really nice for operators because they can't adjust it and get it out of the angle. Um, you know, and, and uh, with our competitors, uh, their, their system is manual. You have to unclamp a clamp, you have to slide it up and down, you're, you're lining it up off a magnet, you got to run down the other end of the press brake and do the same thing, and sometimes you have to come back here and line it back up again. It takes about five minutes to do that. We also offer that type of system, uh, and if nobody changes their tools out, it's called an ACAST LC model. Um, <clears throat> these, um, as you can see here, um, this is the type of part a lot of people will say, well, how hard a part uh, can you do on this? And, and this is just an, an example of where a part uh, has been run with this turned on the whole time, the ACAST. Um, if you uh, would like any further information, please don't hesitate to contact us through uh, pressbreaksafety.com and uh, fill out the questionnaire and we'll get you a quote over. Thank you.